Welcome, 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 welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time, we reunited a strange little band of misfits together. This time, we're back on a train. But wait a minute. Aren't I supposed to be doing main missions? Well, we're going to do one more. Like I said, one of my goals is I want to do more challenges per episode just because there's 90 some challenges. There's actually 90 challenges. And I have no idea how much longer we have in this game. Story wise, we're about a third through, which is like, holy cow, we got a long ways to go. So, what we're gonna do first is we're gonna Valentine. Let's skip this. Alright. This is gonna be the dumbest one, probably yet. I think he'll got the hatchet to, or time of haunt from like infinite, infinite rain. All right, so horseman here and me, we're going for a ride. We want is a bounty mission. That's random. Um. I want to go more of heart of Valentine, and then we're going to do the run or the drive from here to. Uh, I do know I do need to do bounty missions, but now is not the time for that. Hey, hey, let's talk no about problem. Arthur, Arthur, come lend a Wait, that person knows who I am? That's weird. All right, we're going the roads. Let's go. Wish I'll give you a notification like Are we there? Can we do it now? Can I drop this. Uh, that would have been bad. Yeah. All right. So we have to run, drop that long. See how by it will count. Five minutes doesn't seem that long, but at the same time, five minutes is that long. So we're just gonna keep. Just keep sprinting, just keep sprinting, sprinting. Elephant. Five minutes really isn't that bad. Hopefully we don't get anything crazy with random encounter. Give him some of that core up, and then we can keep moving. Oh, my x is extremely loud. I don't know if you're hearing that constantly. Oh, no. I apologize if you are. Come on. Get this thing back to half, and then we'll keep down again. Yeah. Oh, don't run into me. 
me, dear. I'll just ruin my day. Go. Morning. All right, try this again with full sprint. One of my horses is good enough to do this. I want to rob it. Screw you. Yeah. It's one of the other things I need to rob. I think it's the last thing I need to rob. Kind of think of it. Almost there. Random encounter. Encounters. Or are they are they chance encounters in this game, I think. Yes. Mission accomplished. I don't want to do that immediately. Is there a stranger? Alright, well, let's go do some main storylines because I did my challenge. Do need to go to the trapper eventually. That would probably be the best course of action. Maybe they have small containers. I gotta see Billy Williamson, which is never a fun thing. You got it. I don't care that much. Good job, guys. You're free. Congratulations, Bob. Serves him right. Yeah. 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 Yay, we made it, guys. Ah, oh, hi, Bill. We need to talk to Me? you. So, what do you think of this place? Better than your little hermit camp, right? Oh, it's wonderful, Arthur. Thank you for asking. Hey, Arthur! Yep. Got our fishing mission with Jose of Kieran. Morning, Arthur. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Hit the goddamn bank with us. With you? <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. Ain't it for serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> okay. I suppose. It's worth taking a look at least. 
If I'm gonna be performing, I better go get changed out of these rags. Give me a minute, gentlemen. Okay. So, Bill, this better be good. It is good. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. Mr. Morgan. Uh, Mr. Ass? That man. The debtor, Thomas Downs, apparently he's dead. dead. What? Huh. Well, no, he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. Yeah? She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. We lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. What's the plan, then? Oh, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a uh, insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. All right. Hey, wait a minute. Follow me. Wasn't that the guy who coughed on us? I swear, if I called that, I'm disappointed. For I know my disease is way too well. Why are we just casually? Tell me again about this big can't go That's wrong plan of yours. Oh, it can go wrong. Anything can, once the shooting starts. Well, that's reassuring. Like I said, we'll see how it looks. If we can get in all right, we'll send Miss Jones ahead to the bank. They won't recognize her. I'll show you boys how it's done. What are you thinking this time? I don't know. Fellers always like the lost little girl. Nobody plays a drunken harlot boy like me. Mm. Eat should work. Once she's got him distracted, we'll move in. When I was scouting the place the other day, there was only a couple of guards. We Why deal with them there? and any customers who are feeling brave. And you always fancy yourself as the vault man, right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought me. Hey, I'm more than willing. Nah. Best I do it. Oh, and did Dutch tell you I've also been cooking up some deals with them gray boys? What? No. What kind of deals? See, you don't realize, Morgan. I'm out there putting in the work same as you. I've been drinking with them a couple times now. Seems they're looking for some extra security. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Could be something in it for us. Well, just be smart about it. Got a lot of irons in that fire right now. Yes, I know, Morgan. So, how are you feeling about this, Lenny? Well, at first I thought it was a bad idea. But then I figured... Wait, Lenny's with us of all people? if you think about them long enough. Certainly have been recently. I mean, why the hell not? Roll with it. I just told him we needed you along. I appreciate the confidence, kid. And if we didn't rob this bank, we really would be slipping. Thoughts like that. And you one of us no doubt. Now. So I hope so. Alright. Guess we're doing this then. Can't believe you got me going back to Valentine. Don't tell me it ain't hurt you leaving that bank behind. Not really. Work a town and not hit the bank? <laughs> That's downright pathetic. I guess we went a bit beyond working it. We shot the place to hell. You did, Morgan. Not me. I played it cool up there. Couple of punch-ups. Dealt with some old driscolls. Ah, oh, is that right? Like I said, you mess up, it's just one of them things. I mess up. I'm the prize idiot. Well, you are. Bill, I don't know what to tell you. Surprised you ain't already ripped me about that dynamite again. One mistake, and I'll never live it down. What do you need? Pat on the back? A medal? Just know, I got the lead on this one. Uh -oh. We'll see about that once things get going. So. Thinking this through, we rob Cornwall's train, we shoot a heap of his men in Valentine, we rob his stagecoach. This is just dawning on you now. And now, we're going back to the one place he knew where to find us. 
That's the genius of it. Folk never look at what's right under their nose. I ain't sure that's always true. What's happened to you? You're getting real nervy in your old age. The last few weeks happened. Forget about Cornwall. He can't have many men left at this that's point. Orange. Got a bit hairy in that barn, but we all walked away fine from that. Didn't walk away with much. If four of us could deal with them in Valentine, and four of us could deal with them after the coach robbery, I ain't too worried. If Good you point. say so. You did well with that gang and Shady Bell. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> and I heard the rest of them have moved on from there now, so we must have sent enough of a message. I reckon so. I ain't lose much sleep over them fellas. Me neither. They'd have loved nothing more than to strang me up. That weren't gonna happen. <laughs> not through lack of trying? Nah, not to you. You'll outlive a lot of us. Good haul, too. That dynamite should come in real useful today. That'll have to wait. We're here. Let's take it nice and easy. You know, I feel like I'm gonna say something a little bit weird. I think the only thing I have, like, there's like one strong female character I've met so far of our gang. And I kind of wish there was more. Um, uh, Miss Can Callahan, I think, or whatever. You know, the one chick that did that one mission with us when we first got to the new area. I feel like we need another like, Abigail to step up or something. It's kind of weird, but that's just my thoughts so far. Good morning. Howdy. Those old Driscoll boys never seen this one. I've been paying attention Wait, am I wanted here? Okay. Let's leave the horses here off the main drag. All right, gentlemen. Here we are. Okay. Get ready. Oh, I'm using. Oh, this is. Karen, go to work. Oh god, her name's Karen. Remember that joke last episode? All right, keep it cool and follow me, fellers. So, we never decided. Is it lost little girl you want, or the drunken harlot? Uh, I'll go with the uh, I think I'd like to see the little girl lost. So even you long to save the fallen women, eh, Arthur? You break my heart. <laughs> you really do. <laughs> if you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. We got this. I'm not sure this is quite the place. Okay, we're going. No, uh, hold on. Wait till she's gotten real down. Would you care to? I was a child, and I don't want to go back to the workhouse. <laughs> Get your goddamn right, go. hands up! Go. I want both weapons. Nobody move! Get word up! Nobody move! Don't make us hurt you! Here! Unlock the door! Okay, the door's unlocked. Shouldn't we put mask ones for that? Or. Oh. Oh, you think we're here? Fun! Open that goddamn vault! Oh, open it! Oh, oh. No. Don't make me hurt you. How's it looking? Are you in? Nearly. This son of a bitch needs to get a move on! Okay. Okay. Hurry up. I don't want to beat him because he's actually cooperating.
Oh, you're gonna be. You got him down slow. Three, two, one. Son of a bitch, hurry up! Come on! Okay. I've heard of eating with cakes, you may get knocked out. Oh, I do have bandanas on. I'm in! Someone come make sure the suit behaves himself in here. Come here. Uh, Open the lockboxes now. I, uh, the, the, the manager does that. Uh, I. God damn it! Now what? Guess I'll crack them or blow them up. Keep an eye out. I'll be as quick as I can. Yeah, I think I should be able to crack these. All right, but you uh, better be quick. <laughs> You shut the hell up and stay still. As I can. This is slower, but it's quiet. Okay. I hear people out there. Me too. Oh, I gotta do cracking it first. Makes more sense. Hey, watch him there. Don't worry. I see him. We're getting there. A few more minutes. How's it looking there? Good. Told you. Don't count your chickens just yet. I didn't expect to get seven grand for this. cleared this is looking good how much longer nearly there okay you reckon that's enough now maybe it's never enough well i am ready to get the hell out of here whenever you are i think we're gonna be greedy it's not taking long at all to do this One. Good. We gotta move. Five grand. Nice. Another five grand. I think, um, I think we're fine. Come on, I'll lead the way. Let's go. Everybody stay calm. Holy 
sure you count to a hundred and keep your mouth shut. You understand me? It better. Watch them be like three people here, depending on horses. They know what we're up to. I really wish I got a different weapon. And look, look, over there! Why shoot? Why? Yep, this did real well. Now let's get the hell out of this goddamn town! You know, we, we have a new gun that we haven't touched. Thank you, gentlemen. That was stupid and dangerous. Thank you, Bill. <laughs> we're alive and we're paid. Yeah. I don't see the problem. Yeah, and that is the problem. <laughs> Bill, <laughs> this you. is a very good take. That you'll be happy, even if it did come with a heap of trouble. Hey, it was fun. <laughs> well, maybe you're right. <laughs> Now, go on, get out of here. I have some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp, and make sure you ain't followed. Someone's gonna be dumb like Bill. This is Downs. Oh, I have to go there now? Uh-oh. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Yeah. Great majority of the world hates me right now. No. I remember that first hunting mission. That was around here. Legendary bear that destroyed me. Giddy up, Borsi. Giddy up. Hey, wait a minute. How much money did I even get away with that? It's like, no, I just thought.
Hey, remember me? Number one. No, I'm not saying that. My husband's not cold in the ground, and you've come back here. Archie, I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now, I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. He didn't have a choice. He was good, and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you as good as killed him yourself, and don't kid yourself. You had a choice. You speak as if killing was something I cared about. You ever wonder about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Mrs. Downs. Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or a lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. No respect for the lacks of you. <sighs> well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. You best stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. I'll have to take your word on that. Good day. Hmm. Probably didn't ask him how ask her how he died. I'm now I'm curious to see if I was accurate on that. I just made this fun back. Thank you, game. I appreciate that. No way. Okay, I got 2,100 out of that. Dang. That makes me feel amazing right now. Maybe I can upgrade my horse finally. 32%. Guys, next time on Red Edition 2, let's see if we can get that legendary 33. I'll see you then.